Freemasons Hall, 60 Great Queen Street, London. For we are here to celebrate the letter in all its multifaceted glory. Eighth of the 12th, 1986. Dear Sir, it is such a terribly long time since I last wrote to you. Yet how pleasant it is to have a friend to whom one can write everything. What I'm about to communicate to you is the most astonishing thing. Dear Mr. President, I am Elvis Presley. I can and will do more good if I were made a federal agent. <laughs> I'm speaking on behalf of 640 kids who all hate you. You take from my opinion what you like. One, kill every woman in the United Kingdom. Two, give women the vote. You be mine. Bango, I am a star. <laughs> when will you make me a whole woman? Won't it be wonderful to be together, really together in the flesh? You write that you are anxious about whether there will be a nuclear war between our two countries. We're just ordinary people in pursuit of our peaceful life. I only want to live. Some very important truths about the world we live in. Dear David, we discussed your death and your music. When did you know you were dying? Tell them I hope we will meet in the better world. I love my wife, my wife is dead. What lots and lots I could tell you of this journey. I found a deep happiness in it. To not have entirely wasted one's life seems to be a worthy accomplishment. I thank you for your friendly letters. Oh, I hope that wherever you are, these memories are as precious to you as they are to me. You are with me always. Thank you.